What's more American than cornflakes? Cornflakes. The Fourth of July and Uncle Sam. And Uncle Sam. What's more American than baseball? I am. I am. I am. Da, 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 da. What's more American than toothpaste? Rock and roll, peanut butter, toast and jam. And toast and jam and toast and jam. What's more American than OK? I am. I am. The Stars and Stripes, George Washington, the Capitol Dome, and Bubblegum, there's General Grant, and Robert E. Lee, but most of all you can count on little old me, 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 what's more American than ice cream, chow mein, pizza pie, Virginia ham, Virginia ham, Virginia ham, what's more American than bingo, I am, I am, Ours is a heritage second to none. We are a nation united as one. Our founding fathers gave the set start, and their love for our country lives on in every heart. What's more American than football? football. TV and mighty Superman. What's more American than Swanee? I am, I am, I am The Bill of Rights, the Bill of Rights. And, Betsy Ross. and Betsy Ross The Liberty Bell And Paul Revere's horse Old Santa Claus And a Christmas tree But most of all you can count on Little old me, me, me What's more American than praying In a church of your choice across the land What's more American than saying, I am, I am, I am. What's more American than saying, I am. And right, now, and right now, it is 3 o'clock, and I've got to take a break from the music and get right back to you with the news. Okay, Ted Baxter, take it away. Thank you, Gersha Teller. Well, first off, we're going to go back to the robbery that's, a, that's, a, that's still in progress. Go ahead, Copter One. Here I am in Copter One, folks. Again with the bank manager, but, and we're still chasing the robber. And he's, on his, and he's nearing his hideout. Okay, here he is, parking his car, getting out of the car with the five million dollars in his suitcase, going into his eye down. And luckily, I have a police escort with me, so we're gonna land now and catch the burglar. Going on down now. Okay, here I am now, as the policeman going and catching that burglar. Okay, let's go. You got five seconds to get out of there by the five million dollars, or we'll have to bust on in and get our sales. Five, four, three, two, one. Okay, man, I'm in. <coughs> All right, we got you surrounded. Come out with your hands up. We just had the capture of the burglar and the retrieving of the five million dollars. Tell me, Mr. Bank Manager, what do you have to say about this? Well, all I have to say is that I think that guy is lying. But I saw it like a true coward. So, and he's going, and also he's going to jail, so he might give up the life of crime and will not have any more money stolen. That's all I have to say. Okay, you heard it right here live on K station KCWC. Back to you, Ted. Thank you. Thank you, Dr. One. Okay, 
And right now we're going to go right to the weather. Weather boy. Thank <coughs> you. And right now it is. And right now it is 91 degrees. And now it's mostly cloudy. There's a little sunshine right here, but we don't have any rain coming. No sir. Right now they say it's only a 20% chance of rain. But tonight it'll be perfectly clear. And 79 degrees. And tomorrow there'll be a slight chance. There'll be slight chance of rain. 30% chance to be exact. And that's all I had to say. That's it, Ted. Okay, little boy. And right now we're gonna go back to Chicago for another for some more sports. We did our basketball game between the uh, the. Uh, what was it? Oh yeah, the Chicago Bulls and the New York Knicks. And the Bulls have won the, the basketball game with a score of 53 to 50. Hey, well you know, same score as it was in the baseball game. Okay, that's all I have to say about the sports. Now we gotta take you live to the racetrack of Mario Kart 64. Okay, here we are at the racetrack. And uh, Yoshi and Mario are fine, and their wooden knees are heels, and their carts are out of repair. So, and we are about to start a cart race for a flower cup. And we're going to get full coverage on Mario. So, so here we are, about to start the race. Let's go live. Here we are at Toad's Turnpike, and the race is about to start, folks. On your mark, get set, go. And here we go with the race. We're keeping an eye on Mario now, because he's our main man. Mar and uh, he's in third place right now. I have him as Koopa, and I have Koopa as Peach. Oh, and he makes a splendid right arc turn. Oh, and he gives a green shell, which he picks up to Koopa. He's closing on Peach. Just making an arm turn. Oh, but Peach turns ghost. Now Mario picks up another item. He shoots a green shell and gets a ghost. Uh oh. Oh, he got that green shell shot. Right now he shoots the other one and he uses the ghost. And what does he get? Oh, from that ghost he receives a red shell. And he passes those trucks with no problem. He raises his red shell and on a straightaway he shoots it. And what hit Peach is that she, she had a banana on her. And Mario has picked up a dark red shell, he's raised it, and he shoots it. Is it going to hit Peach? I do not know, folks. It don't hit Peach, it hits the wall. But Mario picks up... Oh, man, somebody has shot lightning bolts. And it's Luigi. Oh, man, Mario's now in third place. Oh, and Mario goes back to full size to so is everybody else. Now with only two shells, he makes an R turn on the turn. He picks up an R item, he shoots, and picks up a mushroom. And I asked his final green shell. He didn't have to use it, because Koopa had hit from it. So Mario uses up the final green shell. Uh-oh. Oh! And that, he passes it successfully. Then he uses the mushroom that he got from the mystery items. And he's still in second place, folks. Peach is way ahead. I don't think Mario may take, a pl take first place, but let's keep an eye on him anyway. He's going to up a mystery bot, a decoy bot, and he puts in, he sh lets it go. Now he puts up another item. It's a red shell. I don't think I'll make peach, but he goes out here and shoots it. And he hits him an appia. Oh, and he goes into a major peel out. Ladies and gentlemen, this is one of the best races I ever see in my life. One of the most exciting, too. Okay, and Mario makes an arm turn. He picks up a dog I am. It's a lightning bolt. How lucky is that? And everybody has gotten shrunk except for Mario. And Mario picks up an ampio, but he doesn't slip. He must have hit the brake. And now he picks up a set of green set of three green shells. Mario passes a couple of trucks. Now he's making an R turn. He almost hit an ampio, but the but one of his green shells took the hit for him. This is the third lap, folks. And he's almost towards the finish line. Oh, and he goes between a bunch of Trump magnificently. 
And he passes the finish line with second place. And first place is Beats. Mario is followed by Koopa. And Koopa is followed by Donkey Kong. And the rest are in the last four positions. We're taking now to the results. Mario is in second place with six. Peach is in first with nine. Koopa with three. And Donkey Kong with one. And the rest have zero. And now we go to the next race with Frappe Snowland. And Mario's in position in second place. On your mark, get set. Oh, and Mario takes a rocket boosted start as he times his go just right. He picks